big public service announcement right now. I know a lot of people have been asking for it, but uh, it's back. We're coming back. Let's eat. Let's go. All right, we're here in the heart of Cold Gables right on Lejeune. They actually shut down the street so we could come over here. This is the best butcher shop and the best steakhouse that you're going to find in Miami. This is Shadow Wagyu. Let's go. Uh, well, thank you so much, bro. For oh, letting us hang, hey, bro. Ever since I met you beating you up in the basketball court. Bro, dude. I met this guy when I was like 16 years old. He used to ball on me. <laughs> now I had to, what was it? It was uh, Hoops for Hope. I had to eliminate you guys real quick. No, that was the prelims. No, that was the prelims? <laughs> All right, the prelims. <laughs> We just serve hot dogs, that's it. <laughs> Only glizzy. Give me balls sometimes. On Tuesdays. We got Wagyu oxtail. That's a bone and rib eyes and tomahawk. These are Japanese A5. That shit is like primo, like the best. That's There's nice nothing better than that. How much do you guys go through? Like a week, a month? Oh, shit was this was stacked too. this morning. So uh, each week we get like probably three, four orders and we do everything fresh since we got the butcher shop and the kitchen at the same time. Yeah. So that's how we're able to have everything fresh. All right, so we're here. Alex Prentice, the owner, just hooked us up. He's gonna bring us a bunch of stuff. These are Wagyu beef cavetas right here. So we're gonna have to split this open and see what's good because I don't know. If, I'm a croqueta connoisseur, body by croqueta here. So I gotta make sure that these are legit. Let's take a look here. See that? Oh my god. Yeah, a little. Oh, I owe you too. Damn. Not your typical Goreta. Because beef is different, but the Wagyu is crazy. So the crust of Goreta uses uh, Cuban bread and uh, the green soda crackers for both. No way. Yeah, the ones that come in the tin? <laughs> <laughs> bro, my grandma used to have those all the time. Oh, bro, fire. All right, this is a big moment right now because I'm a bit of a cheeseburger connoisseur. And this is a Wagyu cheeseburger, okay? Look at this, please come, come in, come closer, come closer. I always need you to get closer. Look at this, look at this, okay? This is no, this is no thriller, all thriller. Let's take a nice bite here. That's honestly one of the most flavorful burgers I've ever had. No kidding. Even better than the second bite. All right, so we're here now with the main event. Wagyu Chuchaco. And the fries are not just regular fries. Look at that. These are fries that are fried in Wagyu fat. Okay? I don't know if you understand how important Wagyu fat is to anything. Ridiculous, but let's do a little something here. Let's take a look at this. Oh, that's that's a good looking piece right there. Let's take a look at this piece. I mean, look at the juice on this. Look at the crust, the juice. It's like butter. The seasoning on top, the char with the, the medium of the meat inside. A little pink, like you like your chiracco. I mean, look at this, dude. Look at that charcoal. I mean, let's take with my fingers, dude. Look at that. So good we eat it with our fingers around here. That's what Alex said. He said, you're supposed to eat it like that with your fingers. That's how you know it's good. You don't even need a fork or knife. You just bite it. All right, let's put a bowl on this. I'm almost gonna lick, look. I'm almost about to lick the plate. Look at the juices on this. Everything A1. I mean, this high quality shit. The churrasco, stupid, I won't even talk about it. Like, I ate it with my fingers. I still have grease from my fingers from the, from the churrasco. The queso frito, crazy. The chili guava sauce, insane. The beef croqueta, wagyu beef croqueta, Forget about it. Gotta get down here. Shadow Wagyu.
come through. 